Okay, so this is me right now. I have nothing on my face. Um, I normally put like a primer or something or just like found moisturizer or something of that nature. But I'm going to skip that today because it's supposed to be really hot outside and I don't, um, and I just don't want to put a lot of crap on my face. So this, what I'm about to show you right now is actually a really good way to avoid having to put so much product on your face especially if you have greasy skin like I do or oily skin you don't want it you don't want to put a lot of foundation on in the summer days and then you go out and it like melts and then on top of that you have like your oily skin which makes it even worse so um, we're gonna go ahead and get started so I, what I normally do nowadays I don't use my foundation at all um, or even my tinted moisturizer I normally just put on a moisturizer that has SPF in it but I really can't find it so that's why I'm skipping it but use SPF or like sunscreen or something um, but I just can't find mine so I'm gonna go a day without it so I'm gonna use my Sonia Kashuk concealer palette in hidden agenda number seven and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my middle finger and I'm gonna mix these top two colors right here I'm gonna mix them in and place them in places that I need um, coverage and I'm just gonna take my Sephora mirror to see what the hell I'm doing so we're gonna take my well you can use whatever finger you want I just use my middle finger mixing those two colors I just put one on top of the other and then I normally just place it underneath my eye because I tend to have kind of like bags and then you just want to put it under your eye or wherever you're putting it and just make sure you blend it really well and this is gonna be really quick because I'm actually doing it this tutorial right before I have to go into work Okay, so I don't know if you can see the difference because my lighting is weird, but this covered, this not covered. So I don't know if you can see the difference. And this is very awkward because I'm literally, like my window is right here. So people are like looking at me doing this. Awkward. Okay, so I just did the same. I just took my middle finger and rubbed these two colors together. Had that product on my finger and now we're going to place it on the other eye. And of course you want to make sure that you blend in really well and I like this because it also um, it conceals but it also brightens so as you can see so there we go and then I'm just gonna place it anywhere else that I feel like I should conceal like my zits up here I don't know why I think the summer is starting to get to my skin because I've been breaking out like crazy lately so yeah, so you want to make sure we put that in where you need to and you blend accordingly. Okay, so now that I'm done concealing what I need to conceal, I'm going to go ahead and take my Laura Geller um, Balance and Brighten Foundation in Medium. It has SPF 15. I'm going to just go ahead, it looks like this. Um, this is what it looks like. It's just like a marbleized um, foundation. I'm going to just take... Somebody was just like walking my by. I'm just going to take my Eco Tools powder brush and I just dot it. And then we're just going to place that all over. So where we put our concealer, I just you just want to pat it down. You don't want to rub it in because you don't want the concealer to move. And this makes sure that everything gets blended and that you have, um, like your skin is even. I wouldn't necessarily say it's, like to me it's not a foundation because, not the fact that it's powder, but because of the coverage. It's like really, really, really light coverage, so. then next you can just go ahead and do your makeup like normal um, the, the reason why I like this technique is because you don't you're not putting a lot of stuff on your face like you're not having to put on like primer and then foundation and then like powder and then or your foundation and then concealer and then uh, powder or things of that nature you're just doing two simple steps you're just concealing what you need to and you're just kind of putting powder over it to set it and your skin is still breathing through it and you still look really natural but still like flawless which is really what we're all looking to do so I love this I've been using this every day for the past like month or so so I love this technique um, now I'm just gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows and the rest of my makeup
and I'm gonna just go pretty quickly through this because it's not really a tutorial on how to do like your eyebrows or anything it's more on the technique that I just showed you guys so if you're one of those people like me who doesn't want to like in the summertime put like a crazy amount of makeup and everything try this way and see if it works for you and now I don't know why that I look so damn dark in camera but it's not that dark and that was just my Maybelline definer brow in medium brown and then I'm just using my Sony Cash spoolie and I'm spooling it up and I'm just mixing it up That song has been stuck in my head for forever. Okay, it looks really dark. I don't know why that eyebrow on camera. But it really isn't. I don't know why it looks like that on camera. And then next, I'm just going to do my um, my eyeliner. So I'm really not going to be looking at the camera. And it's going to go by really quickly. But I'm just using my Maybelline... Sorry, not Maybelline. My Wet n Wild uh, Cream Liner. And my Low Cornell... 7450 7, chisel brush that I spoke about in my April favorites video. April favorites. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do my eyes. Alright. We're gonna go with that. And then um, if you'd want to put on mascara, now's the time to do it. I'm gonna go ahead and do it. Just because I have a couple more minutes to spare. So we're gonna go ahead and just put on my mascara and I'm sorry if I'm not like directly in the frame um, I'm looking into my mirror which is why it's like a little further down but yeah so we're gonna go ahead and put on mascara this is more I guess I can call this like my everyday makeup video because this is normally what I do every single day but it's more to show you guys like how I um, avoid having to put so much crap on my face while still looking you know like fresh so now I'm just using the Derm Store lip quench that I got in my like, lip conditioner that I got in one of my glam bags with my Sonia Kashuk um, brush I really don't know what this brush is anymore I think it's like a multi-purpose brush I'm just gonna use my Tarte Amazonian clay blush in doll face which looks like this it's a really pretty light pink and I'm just gonna swirl that in there have some product on there and then smile and just put it right on the apples of my cheeks because I like to go for like a blushed look instead of like looking like you just have a lot of product on your face and then I just tend to like drag it out and this is just something that I do but I just like to put some right here because it gives you like a little like cold look I don't know it just looks cute but yeah so that's that and then for lips I'm just gonna use my NYX lip smacking or what is this my NYX lipstick I guess it's just this in Narcissus and it's just like a very fun bright pink oh yeah it's looking at me And I don't want it to be heavily pink, which is why I'm kind of smoothing it out with my fingers. And voila! That's my look for every single day. So, thumbs up if you like. Um, subscribe, rate, let me know if you like this or not. Um, let me see if you, let me know if you use this kind of uh, like technique, like concealer only and then a powder to set it. And then you just do your regular makeup. And how do you like it? Like, do you feel um, a difference in your skin? Like, are you... Um, do you feel like less caked makeup especially for the summer i really don't want to put so much stuff on my face and this all took around like 10 minutes for everything which is awesome because you just get in and out um i mean 10 minutes as opposed to like i have to take like up to half an hour when i have to like do my makeup my foundation and you have to buff it in and blah blah 
so yeah thank you guys for watching um i'll leave my links and everything down below and i'll see you guys next time